Hey guys, and welcome back to The Last of Us. When we last left off... Ooh. <laughs> um, photo mode. Uh, okay. Yeah, when we last left off, we had to leave uh, and part ways with Sam and Henry. Uh, mainly because they were dead. So, it's time to move on to Jackson Country. To Jackson. And hopefully find Joel's brother, who will give us some more information on where we can find the fireflies. So, oh look at that. Look at the wildlife everywhere. This is cool. You're still trying to clean the blood off that, eh? You're going to start wearing the blade away soon. Right, come on Ellie. Let's move. Ooh, we have some things. I like things. Ah, we're still full. Um, let's make another med kit. Uh, and that's just about all we can make. But that does allow us to pick up this stuff. And we can make another med kit. There we go. Alright, well, that will do for now. Yeah. Just follow the river. It'll lead us straight to Tommy's. Come on. Hopefully, uh, Tommy has had some luck during the end of the world. Ah, oh, and that is going to piss me off, this photo mode. Um, turn that shit off. Well, it's not shit. It's actually cool, but I don't want it on. Um, well, I guess we're not going down that way. All right, this way, Ellie. Stay close to me. There could be danger anywhere. Yeah. Looks fairly safe. I imagine the air is smelling pretty fresh around here as well. What happened between you two? What do you mean? You and Tommy. You're not together, so clearly something went down. We just had a bit of a disagreement, that's all. Ah, here we go. So what was it about? Tommy saw the world one way, I saw it the other. And that's why he joined the Fireflies. <laughs> yeah, your friend Marlene promised him hope. That kept him busy for a while, but just like Tommy, he eventually quit that too. How was it? The last time you saw him? I believe his last words to me were, I don't ever want to see your goddamn face again. Jeez. But he's gonna help us? I suppose we're gonna find out. Well, we're sure without his help, we'll get there. Just keep going. Well... I see, uh, the sib... Uh, Sibling rivalries are still strong, even at the end of the world. Sounds like Tommy's a bit of a quitter. Well, just remember, Joel, there was a time 20 years ago where he did actually save your ass. Still, that was a lifetime ago now. It is peaceful out here. Very peaceful. Nice little place for a spot of fishing, I would wager. Hmm. What's up here? Is this like another way to loop back round and up? Looks kind of like it. Ah, so we can like go down there or we can go up and around here. Huh. Well, we took the scenic route, I suppose. Man. Look at this place, completely wiped out. I love the sound of the water, it's nice. Places like this really give you a chance to think. Oh, hello. What have we got up here? Ellie this way. Oof, bad one. Car that failed to make the bridge, I guess. Uh, we've got a comic book at least. Guess you won't be needing this again, buddy. Savage Starlight. Foreign element. <laughs> Love the art, actually. The victory of the travelers was absolute. And it's so. Uh, and so, too, were the terms of humanity's surrender. The living flesh of every man, woman, and child left alive was claimed as the spoils of war. For how long can Daniela escape their terrible grasp? Huh. 
So humans became slaves then in this reality. Interesting. Hmm. Actually sounds like a pretty interesting comic, to be honest with you. All right, well, no time for sightseeing. Water's getting a little bit rough now. Let's get out of here. Come on, Ellie. Hopefully Tommy hasn't exactly forgotten about me. And we can always... Uh, I'm sure he owes us for something. Whoa, what's that? Right there's a hydroelectric power plant. <laughs> I, a hydro who? It, uh, it uses the river's movement and uh, turns it into electricity. Look, I know what it is. I don't know how it does it. All right. How are we getting it mm. done? Wonders of the old world, huh? Interesting. Okay. And you know what? Even standing back there and looking out over at this thing, this game still looks really nice. It did such a good job remastering it. You know, it wasn't <laughs> no slouch on the PS3, but the PS4 remastering, holy shit, they did such a job. Well, shift all. Let's see what we've got in here. Ooh, very nice, very nice. 50 scrap. Well, we just got a little bit of everything, I think. We've got 70 pills. I don't know whether to get rid of the uh, to use that or to save up for that. Crafting speed, eh? Healing speed, eh? Listening mode distance, eh? Yeah. I guess we're going to go for maximum health, I suppose. They're not super useful, to be honest. Like the upgrades to Joel aren't that brilliant, which is one thing I actually have to say for. Um, the Outer Worlds that I've been playing, like the perk points that you get to upgrade your character with, actually aren't that interesting. They're not that compelling. But never mind. Alright, come on, Ellie. Doesn't look like there's too much we can do around there. What does this do? Well, let's give this a twist and see what happens. Well, that opens one side. Should I say that shuts off one side? Yeah. Well, it looks like the only thing we can do is have a dip in the drink, I suppose. Alright, well, let's go for it. Let's see what we've got underneath. This is some seriously murky water, I know that much. Oof. Let's get some air, actually. Well, we have an underwater shed. Let's go investigate. See what spoils lie within. Anything? Hmm. Not really anything that useful, but I believe... Joel, you're being a little bit unwieldy. Come on, Joel. Work me, buddy. There we go. Nice. You know what? I've missed the pallet technique. Honest, I have. No. No, I haven't. <laughs> yeah, you got it. I like the way uh, Ellie actually reacts to the pallet situation. Because it's just, you know, well. It's kind of... Uh, I don't want to say it's overused, but... It's almost overused. I think the fact they actually make light of it is pretty cool. Sorry, Ellie. This is a little bit rough. Oh, God. I can't actually remember where we put her. Uh, hold on. That looks good to me. There you go. Now, actually, I'm going to go have a little look under here. I can't remember if there's anything else hidden. I actually thought there was some good stuff hidden under there, but... Uh, maybe not. The current's kind of against us too. Yeah, I really thought there was some more stuff under there. Well, uh, maybe not. Well, we're not going to worry about that too much. Let's get over. Come okay, on. There we go. Right. 
Right, nice work, Ellie. Nice work. <laughs> yeah. I will. Yeah, that'd be tragic if we fell in there right now, wouldn't it? Teamwork. <laughs> yeah, good job, kid. Good job. <laughs> All right, what have we got down here then? Looks like somebody tried to make a camp at some point, but we don't know how well that went. Now yeah, we've got some equipment. Actually, talking of equipment. Yeah. Let's replace that. Um, yeah, we've already improved that. I guess we can make another one of these. I suppose. I mean, it empties out our inventory a little bit. And actually, guys, one second. I'm going to go pick up that thing that was back here. Cool. We should, actually. Yeah, we've almost filled up on blades again. Nice. Ooh, bad one. It's too small. I forgot to leave that stupid robot on his grave. What should I do with it? Um, what? I want to talk about it. No. Why not? How many times do we need to go over this? Things happen, and we move on. It's just. That's enough. <sighs> All right. I'm sorry. Let's get the Tommies. Yeah, people die early. It's kind of a very common thing in this world. Too common. Including children, I suppose. There is no karma. There is no good and evil. There is just existing. <laughs> I know, I am too. Get past this place, then we can scrounge up some food. Well, if I starve, you're responsible. <laughs> yeah, way to lay the pressure on Ellie. Thanks. Yeah, I imagine food is uh, quite the rare resource around here. Wow, you can see the grave from here, actually. I wonder if there's anything actually down here. I don't know. Any supplies? Uh, I guess not. Just the camp. Oh, so that's another way down there, really, I suppose, just in case you miss it the first time. So what have we got here? Fedra. Instant security force. Restricted access. Secure area. Restricted military zone. Yeah, well, I don't think that really applies anymore, buddy. Those days are long gone. Head in? Uh, ain't no way around. Gonna have to cut through the plant. Hmm. Great. Now, if we could get that sucker up and going. <laughs> yeah, powerful bit of kit right there, Ellie. Powerful bit of kit indeed. But we've got some dwugs. We've got some dwugs. 80. We need 100. We got more drugs. Let's have a little look inside. Oh man, look at this stuff. If only we could get one of these up and going. We could be like those assholes we dealt with before. Ooh. Oof. <laughs> nice. El Dablo. Yep, this weapon is nice. Well, eh, I mean, it's okay. It only holds one round, but it's pretty much a one-hit KO. It's, yeah, it's tasty, but quite limited use, really. Alright, we've got some nice stuff there, and we have a power plant map. A map of the Jackson uh, County power plant. Okay. Well, let's move on. I don't know if anyone's home. Time to find out. Don't even think about reaching for your weapon. Tell the girl to drop hers now. Ellie, do as the lady says. Hey, please tell me you're lost. Ellie, we didn't know the place was occupied. We're just trying to make our way through. Through to where? 
They're all right. But you know these people? Know him. He's my goddamn brother. Tommy. Holy shit. <laughs> How you doing, big <laughs> brother? Goddamn. Yeah. Let me look at you. You get fucking old. <laughs> Easy. Won't happen to you, too. This is Maria. Be nice to her. She sort of runs things around here. Ma'am? At least we're not blowing my head off. Would have been embarrassing, considering you're my brother-in-law. We all gotta get wrangled up at some point. <laughs> Ellie, right? Yeah. What brings you through here? Uh... That's kind of a long story. Why don't we bring him inside? Yeah. You hungry? Starving. Looks like Tommy's done all right for himself. False alarm. They're friendly. We've been dealing with raids. A lot of bandits in this area. It's been quiet for a few days. What the hell are you doing here? I thought I'd find you in Jackson. I've been trying to bring the plant back to life. We had it working before. But one of the turbines went south. We have electricity, Joe. I had. We'll get it running again. No way. Nice. You guys have horses. We got a whole lot of them. Hey, Tommy, give me a hand with this. Sorry, I'll be right back. So there's actually some civilization. Nice. Organized you civilization. Like you ever ride one? I actually have. Where have you ridden a horse? Uh, Winston, this soldier back in the zone. You know, if you want, we can take them riding later. <laughs> nice. We actually have there. living animals hey, thanks, Tommy. That, no sweat. that aren't trying to kill us. All right, let's continue the tour. Yeah, lead on. Earl? Yeah? Why are you here? Weren't you supposed to head back this morning? Still waiting on Halva and the rest of the boys to relieve me. You know, we'll be fine. Just go home to your family. Just a couple more hours. I'll tough it out. Right. Look, take it easy. I like the place. It actually doesn't look half bad. Got a guard tower up there and everything. Not bad at all, guys. Shame we've got to move through so quick, really. Maria. Yeah, go ahead. We're in the control room. Steve's about to start it back up. You want to come check it out? I'd rather leave it alone. It's my turn anyway. I'll go. I'll turn with you. So is Maria. What's her food in? Yes. Come on, Ellie. Give the boys some space. I'm sending Tommy over. Stand by. This will be the sixth time of them trying to get the turbines back online. Damn. We've been here just a week and it feels like forever. Been here a week and you've set all this up? Not bad, guys. Not bad. Uh, Something for you. Last year I went back to Texas, back home. Most of our stuff is long gone. Most of it. Here. Ouch. It's a little faded, but it still looks pretty good. Damn. I'm good. Old painful memories. You sure? I mean, I said I'm good. Okay. Well, I'll hold on to it for you. Tommy, I... I need to talk to you. Privately. Yeah. Okay. Let me just check on my guys real quick. Come on. Hmm. What's going through your head, Joe? I'm very surprised you turned down a picture of your daughter. Very surprised. You've, you're a changed man, Joe. Well, let's keep this tour going. Yeah, yeah, I'll be right with you, buddy. I'm going to check this door out. 
Yeah, it looks like there's some stuff here that isn't nailed down. Well, ink. <laughs> swipe. We've only been enjoying our brother's hospitality for a couple of minutes and we're already looting the place. Hey, nice. Yeah, I'm right with you, bro. I'm coming. Nice supplements. I don't know what you heard, Ooh. but you should see the town. Nice. We're over 20 families strong now. It was Maria and her father. They set up this place with the idea of being self-sustained. We got crops and livestock. Remember how we thought no one could live like this anymore? Yeah. We're doing it. What do you do for protection? The adults take turns guarding the perimeter. Even got an electrified fence to keep plants up. Well, you still got to deal with infected, though, right? Who doesn't? Well, this is the world we live yeah. in. Yeah. Or maybe you don't have to be. <laughs> you sound like Marlene. You're new around here. Sort of, yeah. Joel and Tommy's brother. Word travels quickly around these parts. Mm. Very quickly. I kind of see the resemblance. I see. It's a compliment. Pleasure me. You too. Yeah, well, unfortunately, we're not going to be around here for too long. We're just uh, passing through, sadly. Yeah, it looks like one of these turbines is going. Uh, that one, well, not so much. Do you want to hammer that, Chief? Yeah, you're not really, not really making much headway with that, are you? Well. <clears throat> One of the turbines is going at least. I mean, that's better than nothing, I suppose. No, I like it, guys. You're doing... Well, you're doing something positive, and that's always nice to see. You've actually got a chance of bringing some life back to this place. Hey, Pooch. Hey, buddy. That's Buckley. Not much of a guard dog. That's a good boy. <laughs> oh, bless him. Nice. Feels very human around here. I like it. Nice. These two geniuses are going to bring this plant back to life. We think we got it this time. <laughs> you don't believe us? I didn't say that. <laughs> I'll bet you a million bucks it works. Sure. Make it two. Uh, we're almost ready. Hit us with your finish putting the shield back on. No rush. Hmm. Yeah, well. I am going to have a little look around, if you don't mind. So, smoke bombs upgraded. Smoke now lasts 10 seconds longer. Smoke manual, volume 1. Improved duration of smoke screens. Through the proper construction techniques, the effective duration of smoke screens cover can be improved. Nice. All right. And look at this, we've got a workbench. Anything else? Hmm. Oh well, let's go see Tommy. Let's go see this big switch on of yours. Ooh. Oh, Christ. I imagine having an electricity is something pretty special in these times. Shit. We did it, boys. Nice. Somebody get on the horn and give Maria the good news. Uh, see that? Electric, yeah. You're pretty impressive. Looks like you're at two million bucks. <laughs> It also seems that uh, the safety inspector needs to pay this place a visit. I mean, you've got broken glass on the floor, you've got a fallen walkway. I don't want to guess how safe that crane actually is. But hey, you have power. 
Remember what I said earlier about, you know, you don't appreciate what you have until it's gone? Power is one of those things. Now, where's me bro gone? Ah, he's over here. Yeah, this place really needs to be cleaned up. Appreciate you've only been here a week, but, uh, you know. Crew you got here. Yeah. Hey, they're good men. This place gives them a second chance. I guess so. Give us all a second chance. So why'd you leave Boston? I've been on quite the adventure, little brother. I reckon it's got something to do with that girl. <laughs> it's got everything to do with that little girl. Well, go on then. She's immune. Immune to what? Oh, come on. I know I've seen her breathe enough spores to take down a dozen men. Nothing. Now, I wouldn't have believed it neither, but I can show you. All right. I'll bite. Why bring her here? I'm supposed to deliver to the fireflies. The way I figure they're your boys. <laughs> You finish the job, you collect the whole damn thing. I haven't seen a firefly in years. But you know where they are. Now, I'm not asking for much, Tommy. I just want some simple gear, enough to set me on my way. What makes you think I'd do this for you? This isn't for me, Tommy. This is for your damn cause. My cause is my family now. We ain't talking about some walk in the park here. Jesus, boy. Had Maria get some of your born-again friends to do it. They but got families, too. Tommy, I need this. You want some gear? Sure. But I ain't taking that girl off your hands. This is how you gonna repay me, huh? Repay you? For all those goddamn years I took care of us. Took care? That's what you call it? I got nothing but nightmares from those years. You survived because of me! It wasn't worth it. Oof. I'll bring you the cure for mankind, and you wanna play the pissy little brother? We ain't back in Boston. You lay your hands on me again, it won't end well for you. Oof. What the hell is that? We're under attack. You still remember how to kill, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he does. It's like the only thing he really remembers. Shit. Stop him. Don't let him into the Ooh, building. shit. Alright, well. Damn. Oof. Well. This just got interesting, didn't it? We're already losing men. Let's hope these aren't essential members. Oh, God. This is going to get worse before it gets better. Sit down. Right. Anyway, guys. We're on half an hour, so we're going to have to end it here. I guess when we come back, we're going to have to cleanse this place and hopefully Tommy and Joel can put their little disagreements aside just for now and try and work something out with Ellie oof oh, I hate to stop it when we're, <laughs> we're right in the thick of it but it's getting late so thanks for watching guys and as always till next time